If you're like me and you've done a Windows update today and uh, you've experienced just this random appearance of a drive on your system and you're getting you're getting pop-up messages saying that this drive is running low on space then the reason is that uh, well most probably is that Windows has messed up its update probably and um, decided to leave a drive letter named an actual drive letter specified on one of the system partitions and that's a problem because explorer is going to see that drive then and it's going to start reporting back to you on it so you just have to get rid of that drive letter you may be able to do it in computer manager so if you just right click on your um, uh, you know go into your control panel go into administrative tools and into computer manager or alternatively right click on your pc if you have that icon up and go to uh, manage and uh, go to your computer management here and go to disk management and uh, if you find the partition that's affected i've actually already taken the drive letter off mine here mine was a four about a 450 meg partition and it was saying there was about 33 meg free so if you right click on it you'll find you can't do anything with these at all they just come up with help so if you are in that situation on these you can do change letters drive letters and paths on the you know your actual drives but on these you can't do anything at all so if that's the case you're going to have to install a partition management bit of software to do it instead in my case i chose this one no reason whatsoever other than uh, i tried uh, that one from easy us or whatever and i also tried partition wizard and they both fired my antivirus thing like crazy it just started going mad and popping up tons of kind of red warning messages this one by far the most lightweight only 11 meg and it installed quickly and did the job so if i just load into that software quickly it's really nice and simple and uh, the partition is here and the ones that have no drive letter assigned to them if i zoom in quite close on this you'll see that it's got just an asterisk next to it you just do a right click on there uh, with whatever drive letter you've got change the drive letter and set it to none in there and apply the changes and it'll just i mean it'll still be there the drive needs to be there it's not it's not a problem it's just you don't want to see it in explorer and once you've done that my k drive as it is on my system but it'll be different on every system disappears so yeah just get rid of the drive letter leave the drive there do not delete the partition and just as a note at the end of this if you mess anything up it's not my fault okay you know you take your own responsibility it's your own responsibility for playing around with partitions and stuff on your system hopefully you've got an idea what you're doing so um yeah take care try not to delete anything just rename this drive delete the drive letter from it completely hope that fixes the problem and thanks for watching